but you know shopping requires a little bit of uh, snacking, right? Yeah. So we, we got to get a little snack. A little food. silver but you know everybody can't wear sterling silver i can wear either but i definitely like white gold and yellow gold well i want white gold for you want white gold mom yeah. say hey 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 mom say hey boo just say hey 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 boo no. macy's macy's right holiday shopping we are in the jury department and we are checking on some earrings I'm gonna hope so. If not, I have to bring them back. Just yes, keep that tag attached to them. Yes, ma'am. She's just My daughter says, smell it. Can you smell it? Mm -hmm. Can you sniff Unless that? Unless she has something <laughs> else. She's so silly. <laughs> I'm finna record us in the car. That's what I'm trying to do. You driving. We in the car. Driving. We're not driving. We're rolling. We're doing rolling, like five rolling. miles per hour. Like, seriously. All we did was go one place to the mall. And, um, yeah, it's gonna take us more than twice as long just to get home but oh but i gotta go to um i thought i'd just add a little bit more let me see if i can't compile these into a little vlog doing this on my phone every day we'll see how i go you see how my mama see. looking like what you talking about really <laughs> look y'all it's three generations my mama me my daughter silly all right check back in in a little bit bye ooh, 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 ooh. we're in the parking lot of the infamous Happy loving. Let's go in here and see how much we can not spend. Y'all, y'all, y'all see the flick of the wrist? Look, look, look at that bracelet. Look at that. Let me zoom in. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, yeah, she lit. Look at that. Cute. So we are now at O'Reilly Auto Parts, and I, and my crazy self, have gotten a glimpse of myself in the best Hey guys, so I thought what better way to vlog than to actually show the beauty of my house. It is super, super cute. Um, the one over there is actually my neighbor's home, but it's super, super cute. I love it, but this is how our yard looks. So we got a lot, a little, a lot and a little bit going on. So super, super cute. I love it. We definitely love decorating our home kind of extremely. <laughs> So over here, I'll kind of work my way left and right, but over here we have our giant snowman with a mouse that pops out of the top. It is super cute. Let me show you guys. He's super cute. He kind of pops in and out of the hat. It's really, really cute. <laughs> and it's funny when it gets really, really cold outside, he chooses not to pop out, which is hilarious. It's almost like me and my kids. I'm not going outside. <laughs> and so here we have a cute little elf and then we have like a little rain dog and a tiny tree and then a little Santa Claus. And then it's another reindeer here with a moving head. I'm not sure if you can see that well, since of course it is dark. Um, and you know, it's kind of not super, super easy to see, but you can kind of see that his head is moving. So super cute, love that one. Over on the side of the house here, we have an arch. Last year we put the arch in front of the front door and it was kind of cute, but it kind of blocked some of the stuff we had going on on the porch. So this year we chose to put it on the side and it kind of has like Santa and some reindeer on top of it. And then we have one of those, um, <sighs> forget what they're called, but the little slide thingamajiggy that projects things onto the house. And so on this side of the house, we have one that's got like bells and snowman and presents and things like that. And so let me move it back some. All right, so let's hope I don't trip on one of these wires holding some of these actual things. So then we have lights all over the top of the house. And then onto the porch, we have a little pillow. Y'all know I'm Buffalo Plat obsessed. So we have this one here that says, let it snow. And then behind the bench, we have this little light up kind of pole. We've got a snowflake and a red car in the window. And then here we just kind of line the front rock area with some kind of green lights. And then we have this cute little reindeer and sled here. And I think my favorite part is the fact that it comes with the cute little presents inside. I think that's just too, too cute. <clears throat> and so then over here, 
we have like this cute present and then we have a mailbox that says letters to Santa absolutely love that and of course we got garland on the door um, excuse me on the columns <laughs> And then on the door, we have our cute little wreath with the R in the middle for our last name. And then here we have some presents underneath the trees that sit to the side of the door. We got a Santa over here that says Santa stop here. And then on this side, we have another pillow. It says, baby, it's cold outside. And then in the window, we have another snowflake and a Christmas tree. And then down here, we have some more lights, excuse me. <clears throat> And a little red car which is super super cute it normally has like a christmas tree sticking out of the back of it but the wind has been horrible here so it keeps like literally blowing the whole car over it keeps blowing over the little side view mirrors and everything so <laughs> hubby keeps having to come back out here and kind of put it back together but then over here in the front we have these two nice balls got these from or ornaments i should say got these from kirkland's probably two years ago so they've kind of taken a beating with the weather um each year but they're super super cute with the r on the front i love the both of these we did pick up some new ones this year um two new ones with the r but we chose to put them in the house so they look really really cute in the house and so let's see if i can move back a little bit so in the upper window here we have a tree and another snowflake and then on this side we have another red car and another snowflake so it really kind of ties it together um to have them the way that we do with the four um corners so love that and then over here we have our um tiny light up tree and then this is what i call candy cane lane we line our driveway with candy canes on both sides and i absolutely love it i call it candy cane lane i love driving up here every year for christmas time and then down here at the bottom we have another one of our trees and then we have another cute little santa and so let me see if i can get to the back of candy cane lane and just show you guys how it looks from this angle isn't that cute Y'all don't mind me. I'm just silly. I love it. I love it. I love it. And so over the um, garage, I should have turned off that light so it wouldn't be so bright. I'm sorry, y'all. I should have turned that off. But um, in the middle of our garage doors, we've got this cute Merry Christmas sign. I love that. I picked that up from Kirkland's a couple years ago. And then I just have these large wreaths that I actually um, kind of DIY decorated. I brought just a plain green wreath and then just put a bunch of stuff on it and some lights. I need to see if I can find brighter lights because I feel like they're very dim. In comparison to like the rest of the lights and the rest of the house like the lights on the columns are like way brighter than the lights on the wreaths but I don't know I could just be being petty but there is another cute little white Christmas tree up here and if you can peek and see that's actually our fence there where you can see like the red lights right there we have our fence lined in like red and green lights so super cute so let me go down candy cane lane So here we have a cute little snowman and another one of those spiral Christmas trees. This one's a little bit taller. And then back here, we have a couple of cute little guys. So we've got this cute gingerbread man here. We've got this lovely little polar bear. I love him with his little red hat. He's one of my favorites. Then we got this large polar bear here with Santa Claus writing. He's holding a Christmas tree. And then of course, He's got his Santa sack with all the presents and stuff inside of it. So super, super cute. Love that one. And then we've got us a nice little reindeer here. And another light up deer here. And then this one here, we need to work on him. I don't know if there's a short or if the lights keep going out or what. But the head and neck do move up and down. Um, but it's like one night the lights will be working and the next night they won't. So I don't know. This weather is crazy. It's always keeping things moving. If you see here, I'm stand still, see if y'all can see it. Maybe not, but the wind's not that bad right now. But this is a cute little North Pole sign with a little penguin on top. But it was rocking pretty good. I'm not sure if you can see it, but the wind is pretty much making things kind of move around. And sometimes it does loosen up the wires. So... <laughs> We have Grinch here on the porch. Let's see if we can get him. Can we get him? No, he done snuck back in the house. Hubby stepped outside in his little Grinchy pajamas. <laughs> so, this is our yard. Oh, the side of the house. Let me show you the side. Sorry, guys. All right, so let's see here. All right, so on the side again, we have one of those projector things. And 
on the side on this one it's like gingerbread an ornament a tree and a present so super super cute and this window here is kind of hard to see let me see if i zoom in if you can see it better a little bit but that's another one of those snowflakes but that's actually my babe cave window so just thought i'd point that out <laughs> since i am on the outside of the house but this is what this side of the house looks like and then i'll just walk a little bit and see how much of the backyard i can show you guys we've got a pretty decent sized backyard and of course we fenced it in when we first moved in five years ago my son was younger and we wanted the privacy and the ability to be able to, you know let him go outside out back and kind of run around and have a good time so this is what the backyard looks like as far as the lights but yeah real quick i just wanted to show you guys a quick little overview of the house and the decorations and kind of what we have going on on the outside hubby and i um <clears throat> we really 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 enjoy doing all these decorations and stuff me and the kids usually come outside and help hubby um you know like we kind of do it all as a family as a team we set it all up together um but this year we did do it a little bit different um the kids and i stayed inside and we did all the interior decorating and trimming the tree and all that fun stuff hubby doesn't really like trimming the tree he's like that's boring this is the fun stuff outside <laughs> So he comes outside and he does all this wonderful stuff. So love how everything came out. I hope you guys enjoyed it and enjoy watch the video. So thanks again to coming back to my channel and watching another video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you're enjoying time with your families and enjoying decorating your homes and making them super, super cute. So be sure to subscribe if you're not. And I will see all of you in the next video. Bye. All right guys, bonus footage real quick. Nothing intense, sneak peek overview of what the living room decor looks like.